Blessings from God A blessed and powerful prayer to start your day. Always talk to God first every morning. In the serene moments of dawn, preceding the hustle and bustle of the day, there exists a sacred window of opportunity to commune with the divine orchestrator of the cosmos. As we open the doors of our hearts and minds to God, we extend an invitation for His divine presence, sagacity and fortitude to permeate our lives. Mark 1.35 reminds us of this practice, stating, Now in the morning, having risen a long while before daylight, he went out and departed to a solitary place, and there he prayed. Opting to converse with God at the outset of each day is a resolute testament of our faith and reliance. It's an acknowledgement that He is the fount of all our needs, and that His intentions for us are benevolent. By relinquishing our burdens, fears, and aspirations at His feet, we create an avenue for God to enact profound transformations. Isaiah 50 verse 4 resonates with this sentiment. The Lord God has given me the tongue of the learned, that I should know how to speak a word in season to him who is weary. He awakens me morning by morning. He awakens my ear to hear as the learned. Beloved, as we embark on this sacred journey of prayer together, let us anchor our souls in unwavering faith, believing in the transformative power of our Creator. Let us cast aside all doubts and fears, for in the name of Jesus, we possess the authority to invoke divine intervention and usher in miracles. As we wait upon the Lord in expectation, let us reflect on the countless testimonies of His faithfulness throughout history. From the parting of the Red Sea to the resurrection of Lazarus, God has consistently demonstrated His ability to bring about extraordinary breakthroughs in the lives of His people. In this moment of collective prayer, let us align our hearts with the promises of Scripture and the assurances of His Word. Let us visualize the abundant blessings and manifestations of His glory that await us on the other side of our petitions. As we unite our voices in fervent supplication, may the atmosphere be charged with the presence of the Holy Spirit, igniting flames of revival and renewal within our souls. And as we lift our petitions to the heavens, may we do so with unwavering confidence, knowing that our prayers are heard and that God is already at work in our midst. So, my dear brothers and sisters, let us press on in faith, knowing that our breakthrough is imminent. Let us hold fast to the promises of God, for He is faithful and His mercies endure forever. And together, let us expectantly await the fulfillment of His divine purposes in our lives. Amen. Engaging in conversation with God in the morning transcends the realm of religious tradition or mere checkboxes on our agenda. It epitomizes a potent gesture of faith underscoring our reliance on Him. When we prostrate ourselves before the Lord, beseeching His guidance, we beckon His presence into every facet of our existence. Boldly, we approach His throne of grace, cognizant that He listens to our petitions and stands poised to answer them. Hebrews 4.16 echoes this sentiment. Let us therefore come boldly to the throne of grace, that we may ob obtain mercy and find grace to help in time of need. The allure of conversing with God at the dawn lies in its ability to realign our priorities. In a world incessantly clamoring for our attention and consuming our time, it's facile to become ensnared in distractions and lose sight of the quintessential. However, when we inaugurate our day in communion with God, we synchronize our hearts with His divine will and purpose for our lives. We seek His dominion foremost, trusting that He will attend to every other facet. As we pour out our hearts to God each morning, we find solace, sagacity, and serenity that embolden us throughout the day. Isaiah 40, 31 assuages any trepidations, but those who wait on the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings like eagles. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint. By entrusting our worries to Him, we equip ourselves to confront the day's trials with assurance, secure in the knowledge that He accompanies us at every turn. 
When we establish the habit of communing with God at the outset of each day, we foster a deeper connection with Him. We become adept at discerning His voice, placing our confidence in His counsel, and relying on His insight. Through our communion with Him, we undergo a metamorphosis catalyzed by His boundless love and unmerited favor. Our hearts undergo a softening, our minds undergo a rejuvenation, and our lives become infused with significance and purpose. In the serene moments of the morning, as the world awakens to a new day, there exists a profound opportunity to commune with the Divine. It's a time when the noise of the world hasn't yet drowned out the gentle whispers of God's voice, and the chaos of the day hasn't yet overwhelmed our senses. Engaging in dialogue with God at the dawn of each day is not merely a ritual, but a sacred practice that has the power to transform our lives. It doesn't demand elaborate words or grand gestures, but simply a heart open to His presence and a willingness to surrender to His will. In the quiet stillness of the morning, we can express our gratitude for the gift of a new day, seek His guidance for the challenges ahead, and offer Him the burdens that weigh heavy on our hearts. It's a time of intimacy and vulnerability, where we lay bare our hopes, fears, and aspirations before the Creator of the universe. In the stillness of the morning, as we pour out our hearts before the Lord, we invite His presence to dwell within us and guide our steps throughout the day. Doors that seemed closed suddenly swing open, revealing pathways to unexpected opportunities and blessings. Solutions to seemingly insurmountable problems unfold before our eyes as God's wisdom illuminates our minds and hearts. Moreover, the peace that surpasses all understanding envelops our souls, anchoring us in the assurance of God's unfailing love and faithfulness. In His presence, fear dissipates, doubts dissolve, and worries fade away, replaced by a deep sense of calm and confidence in His divine providence. As we consistently prioritize morning conversations with God, we cultivate a deeper intimacy with Him, strengthening our relationship and deepening our trust in His plans for our lives. Each morning becomes a sacred encounter, a divine rendezvous where heaven meets earth, and our hearts are transformed by the power of His presence. Let us continue to make space for these sacred moments each morning, knowing that in the quietness of our prayers, God is at work, orchestrating His perfect will for our lives. And as we do, we will continue to witness the abundant fruits of our devotion as God's blessings overflow in every area of our lives. Through these morning encounters, our faith is strengthened, our relationship with God deepens, and we become more attuned to His presence in every aspect of our lives. It's a simple yet profound practice that has the power to shape our days, transform our hearts, and draw us ever closer to the One who holds our destinies in His hands. Therefore, let us resolve today to consistently engage in morning dialogue with God. Let us carve out time to seek His countenance, heed His voice, and surrender our lives to His care. In so doing, we will encounter the elation, tranquility, and purpose derived from traversing life's journey in intimate communion with our Heavenly Father. And we will marvel as He works wonders in and through us, magnifying His glory and advancing our welfare. Now to all those within the reach of my voice, let us converge in prayer before the Lord. I implore you to join me in offering this prayer so that you may partake in its blessings. You may also incorporate this prayer into your daily routine to fortify your faith and align your spirit. Let us petition our benevolent and compassionate God, Almighty and Merciful Father, Sovereign God of all creation. I humbly bow before your majestic presence with a heart overflowing with gratitude. In your infinite wisdom and boundless love, you have granted me the privilege to commune with you in this sacred moment. For this precious opportunity, I am eternally thankful. Yet, even as I offer my gratitude, I cannot help but acknowledge the times when I have failed to cherish this divine communion as I ought. There have been moments when the cares of this world have clouded my vision, 
when the noise of daily life has drowned out the gentle whispers of your voice. For these lapses in devotion, I humbly seek your forgiveness, O Lord. Forgive me, Heavenly Father, for the times when I have allowed the distractions of life to pull me away from your presence. For the moments when I have prioritized worldly concerns over the sweet fellowship you offer, I ask for your mercy. I repent of my transgressions and turn once again to you, seeking your pardon and your grace. Grant me, O Lord, the wisdom to recognize the importance of the sacred communion with you each day. Help me to guard this time jealously, to prioritize it above all else, knowing that in your presence is found true peace and lasting joy. Strengthen my resolve to seek you diligently, to listen attentively, and to obey your voice faithfully. As I offer this prayer of repentance and renewal, may your grace wash over me like a cleansing tide, purifying my heart and renewing my spirit. May your mercy cover me like a comforting blanket, assuring me of your unfailing love and boundless forgiveness. And may your presence fill me afresh, guiding me in the paths of righteousness and leading me ever closer to your heart. Amen. Furthermore, I choose to pardon those who have wronged me, just as you have pardoned me. Lord, I affirm that as I engage in morning dialogue with you, you will lead my steps and guide my direction. I place my trust in your discernment and hold firm to the belief that your intentions for me are benevolent. I reject every assault of the adversary that endeavors to obstruct my communication with you, including distractions, busyness, and spiritual deception. I counteract these influences in the name of Jesus and declare that nothing will sever my connection with your love. Merciful and compassionate God, I come before your divine presence with a heart full of faith and expectancy, ready to receive your abundant blessings as I commit to seeking you each day. I humbly beseech you to pour out your blessings upon every aspect of my life, saturating my existence with your goodness and grace. Divine Healer, I implore your healing touch to permeate every cell and sinew of my body, bringing restoration, strength, and vitality to my physical being. May your healing presence flow through me like a gentle stream, washing away every trace of illness, discomfort, and infirmity. Grant me the resilience to overcome any health challenges that may arise, knowing that your healing power is greater than any affliction. Furthermore, I declare your divine protection over my life, Lord, trusting in your promise that no weapon formed against me shall prosper. Shield me, O God, from every scheme and stratagem of the adversary, whether it be sickness, despair, anxiety, or financial hardship. Surround me with your hedge of protection, guarding me against all harm and danger, both seen and unseen. In your infinite mercy and compassion, O Lord, I place my trust and confidence, knowing that you are my ever-present help in times of need. Strengthen my faith, Lord, and deepen my dependence on you, as I walk in the assurance of your unfailing love and care. May your blessings overflow in my life today and always, as I continue to seek your face and follow your will. Amen. Lord, I lift my loved ones to you this morning. I beseech that they attain full enlightenment and wisdom to seek you as their foremost priority. As they do so, we beseech that they too encounter the potency of your presence and the jubilation of your deliverance. Gracious Lord, I petition you to shower them with health, grace, and provision for every necessity. Safeguard them from all harm and draw them nearer to you each day. Lord, as I vocalize this prayer alongside all those listening, I express gratitude for every heart humbled before you at this moment. We unite in concurrence as we intercede for one another, assured of your presence among us as you pledged. We rely on your love and constancy, confident that as we seek you first each morning, you will orchestrate marvels in our lives and utilize us for your exaltation. We assert triumph over every hurdle and impediment we confront today. We declare healing over every physical, emotional, and spiritual affliction. We extend gratitude for your divine shelter and provision, recognizing you as our safeguard and our recompense. 
Infuse us with your Holy Spirit and equip us to lead lives that honor you. Lord, we commit this day into your capable hands. We place our trust in your benevolence and acknowledge that you have remarkable plans in store for us. Assist us in fixing our gaze upon you and adhering to your precepts. May our lives bear witness to your fidelity and embody your love to the world around us. Lord, we entrust our lives into your proficient care, for dominion, might, and grandeur belong to you now and forevermore. Thank you, Lord, for attending to and answering my prayer in the potent name of Jesus. I pray, Amen. If you have been blessed by this prayer, type Amen in the comment section below. I affirm that all the blessings of this prayer are now upon you, in Jesus' name. You can aid us in reaching more individuals and spreading the gospel. You can achieve this by sharing the video with a friend or family member and by clicking the like button. Also, remember to subscribe to our channel, Blessings from God, for additional videos that will uplift your spirit and enrich your soul. We deeply appreciate all your support. You have been blessed to be a blessing. Please feel free to share your prayer requests in the comment section so that we can present them to God for your favor and triumph, and so that other believers on the YouTube platform and worldwide can unite with us in prayer on your behalf. Stand in faith alongside us as we pray. All honor and praise belong to God. May the grace and peace of our Lord Jesus Christ abide with you all.